Welcome to Transit. We are developing a theory on the ways in which social innovation contributes to transformative change in societies. Social innovation is a concept that is used to understand widespread phenomena. These may be the new social movements and ideas, such as the new economy, the slow movement, the solidarity economy, or cooperatives for sustainable energy and maker movements. But also forms of social entrepreneurship, such as crowdfunding and crowdsourcing. These interesting phenomena can be seen as forms of social innovation. The difference with technological innovation, such as the introduction of electric vehicles, is that in social innovations, the social is the object of innovation itself. There are many different definitions of social innovation. In transit, we define social innovation as a new combination of new social practices or relations. These include new ideas, models, rules, services and products. I would say it's, it's innovative in the sense that uh, we actually try to contribute to societal learning from all these small initiatives, clothes sharing schemes, organic foods, car sharing and so on and so on. So there I think we have an important role in actually trying to, to make visible those experiences and try to support could this be copied, should it be upscale, could it be embedded in, in, in one way or the other? One innovative aspect uh, of the work is that uh, we compare cases, but we compare very different cases. And we compare cases of things that are very intangible and they are very dynamic and mobile. What is the role of social innovation in our societies? Could it be a solution for the many societal challenges that we face, such as economic, ecological and social crisis? Nowadays, traditional solutions coming from the market, state and civil society are no longer perceived as fit for solving social problems. So does social innovation contribute to wider social transformation? And does social innovation empower people to deal with societal challenges? In the past, Policy officers suggested that these social challenges need new and innovative solutions. So the underlying assumption is that social innovation contributes to wider societal transformation and empowers people to deal with societal challenges. For example, we ask how, to what extent and under which conditions does social innovation contribute to societal transformation? How are people empowered in such processes? To answer our questions, we study transnational networks of transformative social innovation and their local branches or manifestations in Europe as well as in Latin America. These are networks on a transnational or cross-continental level, working on social innovation aimed at societal transformation. In total, we study 20 networks, amongst others the Impact Hub, Ashoka and Transition Towns. Well, transits, uh unites a lot of researchers on roughly the same topic, namely transformative social innovation from many different disciplines and different countries with each other and we have the opportunity and fortunately also just the money to actually compare a lot of local practices and that is for, for my work that is just uh, fantastic. The other big important thing is that uh, Transit uh, designs this tool or toolkit or whatever it, it is going to be called that uh, will in the long run, I believe, help uh, social innovators to become more successful, more effective, have more impact. And also, hopefully, it will also raise awareness about the importance of social in uh, innovation. Throughout the project, we organize workshops publish practice briefs, newsletters, and go to events and conferences. By doing so, we further learn about the insights of social innovators and policymakers, and we share with you our thoughts and materials. Concluding, we want to develop a theory on the process through which social innovation contributes to transformative change. We call this transformative social innovation. Our theory is grounded and tested in empirical data and it will be useful to academics and practitioners alike. If you would like to learn more about our work, research methodology, networks or download materials for your own use, please visit our website.